So in this tutorial, um, I'm going to show you how you can move text in CapCut. So it's very simple tutorial for complete beginners, but I think it's very, you know, useful if you learn how you can achieve this uh, result to move your text. Because you can add transition to your text, but if you want to move it, you need to do other things. So make sure you watch this here till the very end, and uh, so you can don't so you don't miss any step. If you do miss any step, then you will not know uh, how you can achieve this result. Very simple, but this is gonna be a very short video. So let's jump right into this video. So what you have to do is just to click on text. If you click on text, then here we have text templates. Where you obviously you can grab a lot of text templates, but now we're gonna just use a very simple text, uh, default text, very simple text right now. Just click on add to the tag, to the track, sorry, and now just um, we have here a text. Here, make sure you write um, you are just write your your text right. And now to make this text move, I'm gonna move this text from up. And down, or actually, yes, I'm up and down, and actually around here. So you can add animation to your text, which is which are awesome and very useful, right? Pretty cool animations. But what we're trying to do here is just to move the text. So pretty cool animations. But so move the text. What you have to do is first of all is to select your text, and then here we have. Um, Position and scale. So position, we can position text. We can position our text, move our text, as you can see, and we can scale our text, right? So if you want to move our text, we're gonna use this position. So we're gonna add exactly the start of this, uh, you know, title at the start of this animation or right when the video was uh, this cursor playhead it is right at the start we add a keyframe this is what it's called is what is called keyframe right this keyframe will kind of um will record your move let's put it that way and that's the right way to um explain but you know that's pretty much what it is just will just record the move so now that this this keyframe there's no move but around here we're gonna have a um, change of position so from this position that is not nothing actually i'm gonna move this here or up and to here which is uh change the position okay and now we're gonna have this animation is low because this text is lasting this month of time, but you can string this. You know, you know, you can um, reduce um, this uh, this text. Then it's gonna last less time. But you have to re you gonna you have to redo the keyframing. As you can see, you can move the keyframe in other softwares. You can, but anyways. And now we can just go here and just change the text, move it here. And that we have this animation is because of the fact we actually added only because we added this keyframe right at the start or where you want. Now we have this key, as I said, this move. That's how you move text. I think it's very useful because with keyframe, we can also move text. You can also even move another video. If you select here this one, I'm selected and now I change its scale. Now I have one video here. I'll move this from here to here, right? So I can, the beginning or where you want, you can add a keyframe very fast. I'm not going to make this video too long and I'll move it here. And now from here, the text, the video, this video will go here. You know, very simple, but I think it's very useful. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you can have a fantastic day. Take care.